Hello, Internet. Praise be to God, and welcome back to Paper Mario the Thousand Year Door. In fact, I think we're going to need all the praises from God we can get, because we're essentially right now in the Crypt of Satan. Not even joking. That's basically where we are. So, last time we defeated Gloomtail, the brother of Hooktail, and got a special key. So, we'll actually have to go back to the courtyard that we were in earlier and figure out what to do to get further in this dungeon. But first, we have to trek down these long corridors again. Alright, I know there are wizards around here somewhere. Never mind, there are no wizards around here. One thing you can do... <laughs> That's a pretty cool trick, I must admit. Those statues do really do look natural, but they also have warp pipes inside them. Bonk. Hey, hey. We know what the boat symbol means. It's time for paper boat. Well, not quite yet. Man, where did all the enemies go? Did it really save that I had beaten all those enemies? That's actually kind of awesome. <laughs> yes, it's no secret that I... That there's a pipe under that. that you don't have to play the... Oh, you've solved the puzzle sound effect twice. <laughs> so with these boat panels, we should be able to reach that big mysterious tower in the center. Give me my girl, Goombella. So this next part is probably the coolest part of the Palace of Shadow, and also one of the toughest parts. It's basically a tower filled with nothing but puzzles. Pretty awesome, actually. Welcome to the Riddle Tower. Gotta love this music. Beyond, beyond, beyond. Complete all seven before, before. Alright. So I'm guessing this is before. This is beyond. So beyond, beyond, beyond. Before, before. Oh ho! Oh, that's a creepy looking chest. We get the palace key! A key for a pedestal in the Palace of Shadow. Yeah, we're gonna be collecting a lot of those keys. Oh, hey! Remember these blocks from the original? Well, even the Ultra Hammer can't destroy them. Four stones, twin stones, master of shadow and dark. Two are one, one is two. Ominous. Well, that's all we can really do for right now. We can come back here later and figure out the rest of the puzzle. And if you ever get stuck, Goombella's hints, uh, title hints can be pretty useful. All you see isn't all there be. Stones have power of stars. Touch it to pass through. Thank you for giving us the hints, at least. Can you imagine trying to solve these puzzles without hints? That would be terrible. And we get another palace key. The unseen may yet be felt. 
so that we, the Great Ones, be it here, be it there, I don't like how Bobbery gets pushed back as it blow up the wall. Oh. So there's the exclamation point here. Let's try Flurry. Thank you, Flurry. Never Palace Key. But now we have no use for you, Flurry, so get out of here. I'm sorry to any fans of Flurry who are like, you're not using her, she's actually pretty good. I disagree. And hey, I made it this far, so. Oh, the bones are coming. Eh. Let fall the weakest, then build to the strongest. So we've got the four different types of bones here. we got the dark bones, the dry bones, the red bones. I don't want to kill the red bones, because there's also a dull bones at the far side of the room. So if you missed one of these tattles, don't worry about it. Take that. That's right, I removed first attack because I didn't think I would need it. And the red bones does also have the same effect that the dry bones and dark bones has, where it just collapses and can come back to life. It's just we never really figured that out because it was a required fight in Hooktail's castle. Come here, dry bones. My stuff's gonna disappear. Aw, oh, shoot. Ah, well. That's okay. It is creepy how the chests appear out of, like, pure darkness. Never palace key. I think there are eight palace keys in here that we need all of. This room looks familiar. So this is what they meant by one is two and two is one. Basically, these blocks are linked to the blocks downstairs. So there would normally be a red block in front of here, except we destroyed the iron block downstairs. Likewise, if we destroy the two iron blocks up here, then the two red blocks downstairs will also be destroyed. We'll come back to there in just a bit. But we got two other doors that need our urgent uh, attendance. Straight on, straight onward. Destroy all in your path. Though the stars spurn us. Thank you, Bobbery, old chap. Palace key. 
This is a really cool part of Palace of Shadow, I must admit. One of my favorite parts. If for no other reason than the music. The Shy One hides his shape, but the stars bring balance. The Shy One hides his face. Thank you, Vivian. Lover Palace Key! Two left. So we gotta go back downstairs to the first block room. And I love the panoramic scene when you go up the stairs. It's really cool. So if we destroy that block, we can go upstairs and hit the special blue block there. And now all the red blocks are gone. Final palace key. Maybe we weren't quite halfway through the dungeon. We definitely are more than halfway now, though. I'm hoping to reach the end of the dungeon in this episode. Mario, look at that! That's pretty cool. What is it? Well, we've got the star key from Gloomtail, so... This is where we need all the palace keys. I'm getting excited. the star away from the original. Kind of. Uh-oh! It's moving! Oh. Huh? What? And that's why you can't go back to Gloomtail. What was that? We must go outside and investigate at once. I'm already calling it. We're gonna need more than 45 minutes for this episode. I am determined to get to the end of the dungeon, though. Yeah, might as well. We've been waiting for you, Mario! 
What? Professor Frankly? What are you doing here? Thank you so much for opening the door for us, Mario. Yes, that was nice. Thanks to your do-gooder predictability, my plan is progressing very smoothly. Opening the door for you? What do you mean by that, you total hag? <laughs> so you still don't see it. Ah, such fools. The Professor Frankly you were with when you opened the Thousand Year Door was none other than this little freak in a sheet. Uh, yeah, my name's Dupus, but... <laughs> the real Frankly is sleeping off a nasty bump on the head in a closet somewhere. Poor thing. And once we get rid of you, our plan will be nearly complete. Ready for the end, my dears? You and that traitor Vivian have a date with eternity. <laughs> That's right, Slick. Eternity. Shut up, freak. Oh, okay. Right. Sorry. <laughs> oh, it's the end, all right. But not for us, Beldum. You guys are going down. Come on, my sort of lovelies. Marilyn, freak sheet. Gah. I said my name's Dupwis. So we get to fight them again. Alright, my kind of lovelies. This time we take out Mario and his goon squad for good. So, if I catch you slacking, you'll be in for incredible punishment come tomorrow. Gah. Okay, 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 okay. We get to fight the Shadow Sirens and Dupwis. This is amazing. So we've already tattled on all of them, and isn't it ironic that now Dupus really wants people to call him by his name? So I'm actually going to hold, uh, do Bomb Squad, which is something that I have not done before. Throw free time bombs that will explode one turn later. Ideally, I'd really... Oh, this is gonna be good. <laughs> oh, boy! I forgot about that. I think I still have Ice Power on, which is good, so that deals less damage and reduces my chances of actually getting frozen. I am going to show off Supernova, which is the <laughs> star power we got for beating Magnus 2.0. It's basically just tap A as fast as you can to fill up the meter as much as you can. I am not very good at tapping A myself, but I am decent at this. One more. Come on, one more. For good money. Come on, come on, big money. Yes! Oh, that was awesome. Alright. I really don't want to have to deal with uh, Marilyn's superpower, so. Gah! Curse you, Mario! This is so very annoying! Blast it! Are you okay, Marilyn? Gah. Well, she's about to blow up big time, so. <laughs> oh, that was good. <laughs> oh, nice. Oh, you know what that's time for. Oh my gosh! <laughs> this is giving me deja vu! <laughs> this is giving me heavy deja vu. How dare you! More chances to- Uh oh! We are killing Marilyn as fast as we can. Alright, Vivian. Ooh! Let's try and infatuate. Blow a kiss to on all enemies to confuse them. So basically, press 8 the instant a heart appears over the enemy. Well, that was terrible. It's okay, Vivian. You try. So Beldum's being super annoying, but at the same time, <laughs> we need to get uh, Dupus's HP down a bit. Let's try that again. Yes, they're both confused. Oh. Oh, he's actually copying Mario. Hey, you freak sheep! Pull it together, will you? Don't make me punish you. S Sorry. Oh, 
Also, did you hear that? When Doofus jumped on me. Oh, I can get frozen. When Doofus jumped on me, it did the Bowser sound effect. Let's try Fiery Jinx again. Or, not again. <laughs> he just can't make up his mind, can he? Ouch! Vivian, take your revenge. <laughs> Woohoo! Look at those star points! <laughs> nice! Well, obviously, BP is the best. <laughs> At this rate, she will never. Oof. Good. I'm sorry, sis. Don't apologize. They were terrible people who abused you. That's Beldum of the Shadow Sirens. Remember, Vivian's sister. I'm totally surprised she followed us all the way out here, though. And what was that plan she was yapping about, huh? This sounds bad. That's Marilyn. I still can't really get a good read on her, unfortunately. She doesn't seem like such a bad type, if you ask me, but who knows for sure. That's Dupuis, who I guess is a Shadow Siren now. Not a bad Frankly impersonator. Gosh, I hope nothing bad's happened to the real Professor Frankly. And why is Dupuis working with the Shadow Sirens anyway? Too many questions! Good question. All right, now we're going into the bowels of the Palace of Shadow. I could really use that Thunder Rage. That Thunder Rage is actually going to come very much in handy for one of the or er, for one of the final bosses. Final boss has tons of forms, so. I love the way their mouth moves. Darr! They're so derpy. Alright. Need me that Thunder Rage. It's gonna be super useful. Okay, I didn't I underestimated Shell Slam. Shell Slam is really good. It's always the really tough one to reach, isn't it? Where they just make you use Flurry for this stuff. <laughs> Come on, Sid. Okay, you can't even hover to that block. Oh, hang on a sec. Oh, no, never mind. I was wondering if that you could tweak through that. You cannot. Good that we're using coops again. <laughs> Repel cape, but that's too many items. Uh, let's see. Repel cape is not that good. Plus, I can just use flurry, one of flurry's special abilities, to just make me repelling whenever I want. <laughs> hmm. 
Oh, well. Actually, I've forgotten a lot about this dungeon, so... Ouch! Well, that's not very nice, is it? Oh, that's nice. There's a trampoline there. So I believe it was yellow that was to the far right of the first gap. So, wonk. Because I believe if we make the left block lower down, we can use Sid to hover across to the other one. Or actually, it's more like this. Yeah. Because now we can hover across the gap. We cannot hover across that one, though. It's gonna be hard to use Coops and Special for that, so... I believe that's the way... F oh, this might be the way I'm supposed to go. Yeah, that's the way I'm supposed to go. I bet I missed some bonus stuff. Oh, shoot! easier to get on it. Oh, no. Darn you, Sid. Even though that was completely 100% my fault. There we go. Wait, that's it? That's it? Nothing secret in there. Alright. Now we get to use the ultra jump. I've always thought that that was a loop at, on the ceiling. Or like it's the same pipe that just does like a loop to loop. In hindsight, it's probably multiple different pipes. Yep, that's why you don't want to fall down there. Spikes. Not good. Hi. Oh, hi. Um. Shooting Star, that will also be useful. Uh, I don't really need Ruin Powder. Hmm, 
that's not good. You know what? It's about time I showed it off. We'll do Body Slam. Basically, the cursor is constantly going to be moving a little bit. We need to move it into this bigger one. Well done, Flurry. Oh, it's the one in the back. I am not confident Flurry can kill him in one hit. Bobbery, I bet he will. Well, I don't really want a stopwatch, so... Later! Oh, yep, that's an ever-timed platform. <laughs> Let's show off Goombella's final move. Rally Wink. Wink at Mario to give him the courage for an extra attack. So we have to tap A and B as shown. A and then B at the end. And Mario's attack turn increased by one, so now we can jump on this loser. So memorize the pattern for these stars. One, three, four, six. Thank you, Coops. Yeah, this whole area is just a giant maze. Ooh, that's good. As a fact, as a matter of fact, that's so good. I am going to eat a fruit parfait. Yes, I'll use it on Mario. Do not disappear on me, White Shroom. Good. Oh, also. I didn't equip any new badges after getting the BP upgrade. How silly of me. Power Bounce could be good. Power Bounce could be very good. So I believe for this, you can jump up yep in tube form. It's kind of tough. Alright. Hey, you. I'll fight you on my way out, but don't mess up my groove. Alright. Now you may mess up my groove. Oh, it's just one. Rally Wink again. some truly tough puzzles in this dungeon. So it's pretty easy to get stuck, but now we've got this working, so... Hup. 
Nice, nice jump, Goombella. That was really good. I did not try to push you off. I am better than that. Okay, I think we're basically at the end of the dungeon now. Just a few more rings. Oh, it's been a while since we've seen these. That's pretty good. Hidden block there. We get a point swap. Swaps your partner's HP and FP. Cannot exceed max. Well, let's see what we must get rid of. You know what? I mean, that's not a very good item. It's really not. And we can buy them for like eight coins at Glitzville, so I don't need it. Why do I have Flurry out? We're getting now from Vivian. Just in case. We need to hide. Let's hope you're good at the paper airplane. Well, I landed on the lock, so that's pretty cool. Ah, hi. Hey, how you, how you, man? How's your day been going? Potator. I can't resist fighting all the enemies. I can't. Oh, hi. Um, no thanks. I do not like fighting the dark wizards. They're annoying. The embers are not too bad at all. Especially if you give Mario multiple weapons. Star power. Yeah, might as well. Let's use Art Attack again, because I am I'm not confident that Showstopper is gonna kill the Dark Wizards. Or Wizard in this case. And I know Art Attack will. very close to a level up now. I just have, like, no star power <laughs> at all. <laughs> Come, Coops. Yikes! Oh, great. I jumped on the chain chomp's head. This will do absolutely nothing. And the screen was shaking because the so was the chain shop. Oh, he's got a thunder rage. That's not good. Normally, I would steal that from him. Except, oh wait, no. 
I don't have room to steal it, so I literally cannot. He didn't use the Thunder Rage. That's kind of surprising to me. Actually... Gotta build up that star power. I'm not sure why I did that. I should have had my partner appeal and then Mario just used Power Smash. Whoops. So for this one, I believe you just need to be really, really fast. So we're going to wait for that to go away. All right. Whew, yeah, that's close. But with the Yoshi, you can do it. And we get a palace key. I believe that's the key to the final room in the game, which is nice. Oh, hey, Life Shroom. Oh, hey, Shooting Star. Two very useful items. Okay, I do not need cake mix. I can easily get more cake mix. Boo Shoot is going to be useful. Koopa Bun and Healthy Salad. Both. I mean, Honey Super is not going to be all that great. Oh, wait, no. Koo Pasta. Oh, pff. I'll just eat the Koo Pasta, please. Uh, I'll have Bobbery eat the Koo Pasta, because he's a little low on HP. Okay. <laughs> I do not know how to get these items, but I will try my best. There are lots of hidden items in this dungeon, and I definitely brought way too many items with me. No, I was trying to hover. done a ton in this episode, though. Alright. Terribly sorry, Cake Mix. I should have stored that. Life streams are going to be very valuable. If not for this fight, then when, at least when we do the Pit of 100 Trials. Alright, that's all the time we're going to have for this episode. Thank you very, very much for watching. I'm Colorful Artie. As you can see by this absolutely grand hallway, that is the last door in the Palace of Shadow. Beyond that lies the final boss. And it's going to be absolutely freaking lootly epic. So please tune in next time. That'll be actually the last true episode of Paper Mario Thousand Year Door. It's a little sad. But yeah, that will be the final episode, and I'll have like two or three bonus episodes afterwards, and then the series will be over. So it's a little sad, but I'm also ready to move on. Thank you again for watching. I really hope you tune in next time. Until then, have a great day, and God bless.